I really never grew up in musical theater. Uh, it's, it's, I just didn't, and it's not something my parents took me to. I lived in New Jersey. I went to a couple of shows, but I really, it wasn't part of what we did. And for me, it, it still, it, it, this script just touched, I just heard everything. When you see it on stage, when I first read it through, and it's different, a lot of things are different, but a lot is, a lot is the same. I just, I just heard it for some reason. What's shaking, brothers and sisters? I'm glad your father's way up in the down. We got the jumping and jumping this music in town. Hey! And it's Saturday night. Beale Street is this tiny little street and at where, birth, where the birth of rock and roll happened. And above it is the, the Orpheum Theater. And white people were allowed to walk through that door and black people had to go up the back steps and down the back steps. Separate drinking fountains, separate toilets, you know, and, and really the show, it, it's, it's the, birth, the birth of the rock and roll, the birth of civil rights, and also where it's a love story. It wasn't a show about, uh, about nothing. It truly was a show about what hate is, you know, and I look at that and then you see how ugly it is and how wrong it is. And this piece through music, without being like a dirge going, racism is bad, you know, we don't do that. You, you come around, you see for yourself, watch it unfold and you see how it is. So it really is, um, that, that's something that matters to me and it's a show that celebrates what brings us together, not what separates us. In a rock band, we go around the world. We've been to 50 countries 30 times since 1983. You know, we've been doing it for a long time. and. It, it, you look at all those smiling faces, all people of different race, colors, creeds, whatever it is. You know, humans are humans. And this, that, that's what really drew me to this piece, is that it really celebrates what we have in common. You have to have that drive. And also, we're not based on a movie. We're not based on, you know, it's an original, story with original songs it's modernized looking back in time you know music wise and uh, it's very hard to get people to put in a lot of, it takes a lot of money to get a broadway show going and an original is a tougher road because it's not a familiar title so we just the perseverance was you know unbelievable and then we came out on broadway and won all the tonys and we waited for another two years to get this theater it's so hard to get theaters there's so many shows and so little theaters got it and you know here we are 13 years later um, I'm at the Shaftesbury Theater and I'm, I'm the happiest guy in the world so ah, it's a great 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 cast we really love it. it's built around those two and, and Killian is, uh, is he was unbelievable in the commitments he's a great actor and a great singer Bev was great in the bodyguard she's she's a great singer and then she's really, really learned the craft of acting. She's really, really a very, 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 very gifted actress. And she worked hard on it. And when she opens her mouth, that is a gift from God. And I'm the luckiest human being in the world for her to sing my songs. Everything I learned from, from Bon Jovi, my band, I take to this. I, I know what it is to sing live. I know what it is to whip of people in a frenzy. By the last song, people are up and clapping, and then the, the, the actors leave the stage, and they stay for, nobody even leaves. The band is playing. They're, they're applauding for the band because they're such whipped in such a frenzy. The greatest thing for me is I'm a performer, so I can open my mouth and sing it, and they go, oh, that's how it is. Because usually Broadway shows are a little bit more tamer, and rock and roll is this as a performer. Your energy is it's an insane amount of energy, and Beverly has that. And killing has. 